Today, we're diving deep into the highly anticipated Galaxy S25 Ultra. There's been a ton of chatter leading up to its release next year, and we have some exciting updates that were just confirmed. So grab your popcorn and let's get started. As we round off 2024, Samsung has officially wrapped up its flagship phone launches for the year. That leaves us with all eyes on 2025, where the Galaxy S25 series is set to make its grand debut. Expectations are running high, and there's already a lot of buzz about what the S25 lineup will deliver. In early August, Samsung made a groundbreaking announcement. They began manufacturing the world's thinnest mobile device memory chips, specifically designed for on-device AI functionality. These new 12 nanometers chips will come in two variants, 12 gigabytes and a hopping 16 gigabytes. This exciting development hints at a potential 16 gigabytes RAM option for the Galaxy S25 Ultra. Let's take a moment to put this into perspective. The last Samsung phone to feature such substantial memory was the Galaxy S21 Ultra back in 2021. So this potential upgrade is pretty monumental. Now, here's where things get even juicier. Well-known tipster at Universis recently took to social media declaring that a 16 gigabytes RAM variant of the Galaxy S25 Ultra is 100% confirmed. That's right, if you were hoping for this upgrade, you can breathe ET. What's particularly interesting is that this won't be the first time a Galaxy S Ultra phone has reached 16 gigabytes of RAM. Both the Galaxy S20 and S21 Ultra offered 16 gigabytes options before Samsung pulled back to 12 gigabytes in subsequent models. So it looks like we're finally getting the high capacity memory back but it's not just about RAM. The Galaxy S25 Ultra is rumored to be equipped with the latest LPDDR6 DRAM modules, a leap beyond anything currently available on market. This means you can expect significant improvements in both performance and efficiency. Now let's talk chipsets. The Galaxy S25 Ultra is expected to be powered by Qualcomm's new Snapdragon 8 Elite built on TSMC's cutting edge three nanometers fabrication process. What does this mean for us? Well, we're looking at potential improvements in both CPU and GPU performance, along with significant advancements in AI capabilities. However, there are still some uncertainties. It's not clear if the Snapdragon 8 Elite will be featured globally simply in the S25 Ultra or if other models in the lineup will utilize Samsung's Exynos chipset in various markets. This new RAM upgrade isn't the only thrilling feature that we can look forward to. The design of the S25 Ultra is expected to be sleek, sporting a titanium body and durable corning glass. If you've loved the previous designs, this is something you're likely going to enjoy even more. And for all the display aficionados out there, the S25 Ultra is rumored to feature a 6.8 inch dynamic A and OLED 2X display with an ultra smooth refresh rate that can scale between one to 120 Hertz. That means superior graphics and fluidity while scrolling or gaming. Now we can't forget about the camera. One of the most talked about features is a potential 1 inch 200 megapixel isocell image sensor for the main camera. With this, you could see a phenomenal leap in low light photography and ultra detailed shots. However, it's worth noting that as of now, there are no groundbreaking changes expected in the camera hardware. In addition to this, we're likely to see some AI powered features that will enhance image processing and video capabilities. Definitely something to get excited about. And what about the price? Well, it's expected to remain consistent with its predecessor with the Galaxy S25 Ultra starting at around $1,299. So what do you think? Are you excited about the Galaxy S25 Ultra? What features are you most looking forward to? Let us know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for all the latest news and updates on tech releases. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.